Okay, let's uh, wrap up model five, okay, dedicated to sampling, plotting, and visualization. So after you've, you have finished this model, you should be able to use function objects or monitors. Now function objects is an uh, open phone lingo. So you should be able to, to use it on the fly, but also a posteriori do sampling and probing, okay? Also uh, use the post-processing utilities to multi mani manipulate data, convert open from data to third-party formats you want to use an external tool. Also in the supplements, we work with Pada, Pada from PadaView, so we address very advanced stuff. And pretty much everything that you can do with function objects and sampling, you can use, do it in PadaView, but my advice is always try to use all, all, all function objects if you can use it. If you cannot do it with function objects or post-processing, uh, post-process utility, go ahead and do it with Paraview. Okay. Uh, also, to some extension in the supplements, we talk about a little bit new plot and some scripting using AWK and set. So also when you are doing this quantitative and um, qualitative post-processing, they might can helpful now using this this small programs no AWK and said and also no plot to to manipulate and plot the data and as usual uh, you should be able not to explore the source code and look information so it's important now also go back to week one okay the first tutorial tutorial one two and three and look at those dictionaries and look at the function object and how we did the the post processing and also the part of you how we use part of you okay so now try to dissect everything we, we, we did there also prepare your questions okay so you have for the q a or is you want to go into details into some other topics because as i said this can be very complex very time consuming okay and in the lectures we only address the most important function objects but there is a lot a lot there since that i didn't cover so thank you very much and see you next videos bye